Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Age of Wonders. Uh, this is Oki here and today we'll be continuing the campaign playthrough of the Elven Court series. Uh, in the last episode we didn't really get too many things done but we're, we're sort of preparing for this big battle that is going to be uh, held this episode. Uh, where we have, what is this, oh, I, I, I'm so bad with, with, with colors. Where we have this enemy over here, the rogue enemy, uh, where we saw a few shadow stalkers, I think four of them in total. And uh, we kind of retreated to 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 bolster our numbers uh, and to get some more units out. And that's that's pretty much what we've, we've been focusing on in the last episode. Uh, we also got two trebuchets uh, with us this time around uh, just to help with the siege and to make it a little bit easier for us to to get into their um, to get into their walls. Uh, and then over here, uh, we did manage to take out uh, to take out one of their cities. Uh, they also took our our city over here, but we took that back quite 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 quickly. Uh, now we are marching these guys down here to start taking out the, the enemy that has been sort of wandering around these these mana nodes for a while now. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be the the main objective is gonna is gonna be to to get these guys over in this direction and to take out our 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 enemy uh, down here. So yeah, let's see. I think I'm still gonna summon one more gargantuan animal in this, on this stack. Okay, it's a mature reed serpent. That's not the greatest, but also not the worst, I guess. Um, yeah, okay. We're making one more trebuchet. I think that's all. That's that's all. That's all fine. I think also after that we're we're just gonna go. Um, because we uh, we then have three stacks of units, and I think that should be good enough to take out whatever they have left in there. Um, you guys, can, you can go over there. You can just make merchandise from now on. That is all fine. You guys can march down here. Same with these guys and also these guys. Good. Their movement through the forest is not the greatest. That's why. Our, our movements are not as fast as they could potentially be. But that's okay, we don't need to move fast all the time. Um, just get a little bit of gold here on the way. And then we'll probably just head over here. There's another, another shaman that I want to get into this battle. What do we have in here actually? Vampire Spider Queen, that is very nice. I would like to get that. Don't even think I want the, well, I'm gonna get it in there, why not? Let's do this. Okay. So our our, our trebuchet obviously is in, a, is in a little bit of a pickle. Um, because uh, it's kind of been uh, been damaged beyond repair. Let's see where where is our our goblin here? Oh, is there somewhere? I literally just care about this uh, about the spider queen. The rest of the units are kind of like yeah. The hunter spider baby might be might be annoying to deal with as well. But I want I do want to keep some of them alive. I'm gonna kill. Hmm. Maybe this was the wrong target actually, because I kind of want to keep the vampire spider baby as well, just to sort of have a backup in case we we get this spider queen very quickly. Um, then we still have another unit that we can potentially just take control of. We cannot. Don't really care about the dread spider baby. Uh, we can summon those very easily. Uh, we have some of those frequently in the past as well, so I don't really care about that. I am going to get out of the way with my Swarm Darter, since then these guys, uh, this spider will just web one of these units. Mm. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, sure. That is one way to go. Okay, fuck it. You're dying. You're dying. And you're gonna get befriended. That's good. So 
so now we have just one more unit to 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 worry about we have a webbing touch here as well let's move somewhere like this So it's probably just gonna web either one of these or, or do that, that's also fine. Let's try and web. Good. And now we can just start trying to uh, convert this. Very good. Two new units, that's not too bad. A much better success rate than the previous one, that's for sure. Oh, and actually a decent shield. Oh, that's nice. That's a pretty, pretty good shield item. Who's gonna get that? I think Sundran, since first of all she's closest, but also um, 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 but also she's the one that is that is at the weakest at this point. And uh, I thought I said it. I actually meant this guy. Uh, I think I wanted to have it on, on, on him since he was the weakest uh, in terms of army strength. Um, but yeah, we're reinforcing this now, so I don't think we need it on, on him. I would rather have it on the melee character since the shield is going to give him... Um, I don't actually know if he gets shield as well, the, the ability. Uh, but at least the two resistance stats are going to be great from 10 to 12. That's a massive increase, obviously. And also another armor is, is, um, is very nice for him as well. So that's great. Let's move above ground here, see what else is in here. Okay, not too many things that we haven't seen before. Okay, good, good, good. So you guys are good, and then we'll just make another animal. Our mana income is sort of, uh, you know, very much... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> very much declining rapidly now but it's fine since uh, we still have 100 mana a turn um, and that should be completely fine uh, you can just make uh, resources from now on for you as well we don't need these guys defending this anymore so I'll also drop these guys to the front line um, let's just make merchandise here as well get in there and go front lining and for you as well good i think with this prospector i'm literally just gonna 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 go through these cavern walls and um, until i reach this i think that's that's gonna be my my objective for the next few turns and i don't think i'm even gonna move above ground with these guys i'm just gonna follow the prospector around uh that that way i can get, let these guys catch up as well and we will actually have a pretty decent army then. Um, yeah, sure. Trebuchet here. And I think now we can start thinking about attacking. Where are we going to attack? Probably this hex here, right? So since they're in a triangle formation, all of the units will join the battle anyway. So there's no point in, in trying to maneuver anything around so that we get a better position out of it. It just is what it is from this point onwards. Good. And another one. Okay. Closely matched. Let's see if that's the case. How many casting points do you have? 80. Mm. That's a lot. Good. Let's do this, boys! Okay, not too happy about that, but that's actually not the worst. Okay.
So, let's give him a touch by faith. Um, you're gonna get woken up. I think I'm gonna give this guy the awakened spirit. Since I think the Shock Serpent is going to be more useful than the Spider Queen, even though it has, even though it's a lead rank and stuff like that, or champion rank even. And with you guys, what am I going to do with you? So we have three trebuchets here somewhere, right? There's another one over here. I think with this guy, I might just start attacking the walls. No, I'm going to attack this wall over here. That's what I'm going to do. Just in the middle somewhere. I'm really happy that they spent... Um, some casting points on damaging these storm systems because I don't really care about them. I just made them to be able to deal with the shadow stalkers. But if they want to spend some casting points on it, then uh, you know it's better that that they spend them on 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 useless units uh, than on my uh, on my heroes, where I potentially have to take them out of the battle completely. So that is nice. This has all been used. Okay. So they also have a few trebuchets, so that's something to think about as well. Good. I think I'm just gonna put them in a, in a sort of like a triangle formation over here. So this cockatrice has a lot of movement, so I need to keep that in mind. That that can potentially be a nice little tank as well, since it has. Quite a some some decent defensive stats. So this trebuchet is not in range at all just yet, and we still have one more unit over here as well. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, they're gonna keep on cursing if I'm not uh, if I'm not quick enough. So it's sort of make my move pretty soon, I would say. Good. Maybe I should have moved my units out of the way and then started attacking the walls, but I think this should be fine. Anyone else cursed? No, it doesn't look like it. So, casting points wise. Uh, 56 still. Okay, not too bad. So I can keep on using Awakened Spirit on my units here. That's, that's good to know as well. So that way we can awaken all of my units basically, and then uh, our our damage. This that's actually a, a really good buff, you know. Three extra damage, five hundred happiness. That is sick, and we can use that on multiple units. That is pretty dang sick. We could also dispel. So I'm, I think I am gonna dispel this actually. Oh no, we don't have to spell. Uh, we get that later, right? Ah, veteran rank. Hmm. Okay, unfortunate. Hey, light thunder. Happy New Year, man! Okay, and the banana tree? Well, well, what is that about? Can you explain that? That is not something I'm familiar with at all. Okay, took some damage there. Some curse action going on. Yeah, okay, these guys are just rerouting. Yeah. That was all to be expected, uh, that they were going to come over here. So what I'm what I'm going to try now is to get uh, as many of these walls broken as possible, so I can I have a way in. Uh, you are still not cursed, but you don't have any movement points left anymore, unfortunately. Yeah, you cannot move. I don't think we have anything else, right? Do you have still enchantment or something? No, but you have cure disease. 
And cure disease works on uh, works on the what's it called the curse. That's great. Okay, so we can we can just cure disease everything. Uh, that's not too bad. That is not too bad. I don't think I'm, I want to move forward just yet. Um, <coughs> because what I'm kind of hoping for is that um, that they're going to come to me at some point. But if they're not, then... Uh... Yeah, so the Shadow Stalks are sort of rerouting. Uh, in fresh banana tree, it said... Banani. Which Lucy sounds like... Banani. Ah, okay. Meaning Happy New Year. Right. Okay, okay. French humor, I like it. Well, uh, happy Happy New Year to you as well. Uh, do you have any New Year's resolutions that you that you want to share with the chat? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna move in now. Use this guy as a as a, as a tank. These guys as backups, most likely. This guy, this guy is woken up. You are as well. Awaken. Okay, I'm gonna use this guy over here. Ah, and we have another cure disease uh, target. Um, so these storm sisters need to be where the shadow stalkers are since they're gonna be what's the units that are gonna take out the shadow stalkers most likely so I'm just gonna take care of these um, these fences over here so I have a, a better angle to attack in um, don't think I need to put rebirth on anything just yet. I think they're just gonna come out now as well. That's what I'm expecting at least. Uh, my three dollars minutes keep keep my new apartment in good shape to reconnect with my best friend. And start streaming! Look at you man! That is a great New Year's resolution. For sure do that. It is very, very rewarding uh, in my opinion. And very, very fun. Uh, let's see, cure disease on this bad boy, since this one is the, this is the strong uh, King Shop Serpent. I'm thinking about going in here and just starting, start using this breath attack. Unfortunately, that's not going to do anything against a trebuchet though. Let's kill that Swarm Darter first and foremost. Uh, that maybe kills, it does not. Okay, good. That's done. That's a done deal. Hmm. I'm gonna give my King Shock Serpent some more Spirit Protection, I think. Because you already have 100% Spirit Protection. Then I'm gonna move him on here just to kind of entice him to come to to me. Petrified, ten percent. Didn't get it. That's fine. So, what kind of games do you wanna wanna start streaming, uh, Lathander? Anything in mind already? Unfortunate. Oh, that is very, very good. Yes, now they're gonna come outside. Oh, that is great. That is exactly what I wanted. Perfect. Okay, this succubus needs to die, obviously. Um, since it has charmed one of my units, which is obviously not great. I think we should be able to, to get that. Uh, so, the 
let's kill some crows. Okay, we can just take away some movement points here. As you can see, our storm is doing quite a bit of damage against against these guys. Actually, maybe we don't need it. We don't need the golden dragon for that anyway, since we have our hero here as well, which can deal quite a bit of damage too. And I think we should be able to get it with this guy. Hmm. Nah, let's use the ranged. Let's use this. Very good, very good, very good. Very good. Yes. Oof. So this thing is dazed. I cannot really do anything anymore. I'll try the AOE plant fall and I'll try to keep uh, to do the RP way. Uh, casting the actual commander. Casting as the actual commander and taking to chat as they have. Oh really? Oh nice, nice. That is that's a cool concept man. I like it. Oh, that'll be fun to watch. Yeah? I'll, I'll come watch you uh, when you when you start streaming. That's that's gonna be nice. Um, how do I do this? That is not enough. So I can use this guy for that, and I can use this guy for this. I think it's gonna. I think it's just a matter of this. Taking away movement points over here. Taking away movement points over here. Yeah, our, our king shock serpent is for sure gonna die. Okay, we already we already used our, our hero unfortunately, so we cannot give him rebirth. That would be nice. It is what it is. If he dies, he dies, uh, and it's not the end of the world. Like I said earlier, we cannot. We unfortunately cannot do that. But what we can do is this. Hmm. Also very unfortunate, but also not the end of the world. Okay. Let's get some damage in on this guy. Good. What else do we have? A fire wyvern. I think we'll sacrifice this thing just so. I oh know this thing is dead anyway, right? To to this attack. Yeah, let's just do this. Sacrifice the fire wyvern for for. Ah, maybe what we can do. Ah, oh, no, no, no. This. <clears throat> I don't want to open. So what I was thinking of was healing um, my king shock serpent with a nourishing meal, um, and then that that way I would be. Uh, protecting it from all sides with uh, from all flanks basically and maybe he's gonna survive then the only issue with that is that we would put our our leader in at risk and uh yeah that would potentially loses the game so maybe not the best solution to this uh to this problem uh root spears no uh well i mean there's a chance that i take all of his movement points away yeah didn't get it. If if I did get it, then the range attack would probably still have killed the King Shock Serpent. Yeah, it would have. Well, that is interesting. That they attacked there. Hmm. 
obviously not what I want to see since uh, you know that is uh, sort of our 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 very crucial unit to us. Um, let's attack over here first. Move this guy guy out to safety. Do we need to resurrect anything? No, not really. Let's attack that. Small chance that we kill him. Very unfortunate, but doesn't matter. Good, good, good. Uh, really? Are you gonna stream in French? Ah, that's unfortunate, man. That is very unfortunate. Let's see, you can... You can kill that. Let's heal something. Let's heal this bad boy. Kill that. Attack that, attack this. Good, good, good. This succubus needs to go. And then this bad boy needs to go. Let's save a cockatrice just because we can. We might as well. Um, you have enough health. And there's only two more units left, so let's start going melee. Yeah, there's nothing else left, right? It's just these two catapults, and this one can't even do anything. Um, do we still have some heals left? No, nope. Uh, can I get any other form of XP? I don't think so. So you can just attack that, and you can kill this hopefully this turn probably not definitely not maybe you king shark serpent leveled that's great as well uh, what else is there oh the leader yeah that is an important piece of the puzzle no days unfortunately but that's okay We'll just finish him off with a golden dragon here. Let's go. Uh, I'm conversational for the for the very least English. Uh, in English, in terms of writing and listening, but when it comes to to speaking, speaking, <laughs> I I dearly lack practice. But that's the thing, you know. That's that's something you can practice, um, and then you get better at it. Uh, at least that's how I see it. When usually when uh, when I and I try and practice uh, practice new stuff. Let's go! Another one defeated. Yeah, this uh, my New Year's resolutions this year is that I'm gonna learn French. Uh, or French. That I'm gonna learn um, uh, Spanish. I I wanted to learn Spanish for a while now, um, and I've always been sort of putting it off. But um, when I moved back to the Netherlands, so I did my I did my PhD in England and in, in Liverpool, and I was actually never gonna, the plan was never to stay in, in the Netherlands or Germany, like I live right at the border. Um, but the plan was never to stay here. Uh, but now, you know, I found a nice job. And then at some point I got a girlfriend, you know, um, somewhere in the past. And um, a few weeks ago we actually broke up and she never wanted to move from here, but I did. And I kind of gave up on that because of her. And now that we're not together anymore, I can uh, go wherever the fuck I want. So, um, that is sort of the plan for the for the for the for the next year is to learn uh, is to learn Spanish and then just uh, try to find something in Spain that excites me, uh, and then learn um, perfect the language while I'm over there. That is sort of my my short my short term plan. Well, I mean I wouldn't call it a long term plan. It's just one year that I'm thinking ahead, but. 
Okay, so another un another enemy defeated. Let's absorb this bad boy. Um, we cannot really move this way because we don't have tunneling. I really want to find out what is over here, though. But I think I'm going to move all of these guys back back above ground again because now the only thing left for me is to to finish off this this enemy on the on the right hand side unfortunately we are stuck on this hex which is not the greatest let's see what else do we take with us i feel like the the trebuchets have to come with us and then yeah just all of the good units i'll leave i'll leave the storm system behind most like most likely don't really need to make anything here i think um let's just make some shock troopers why not they're good units Guard breaker is always a nice ability. Uh, don't need to move there. Good stuff. Good. And move this guy back down. Good, good, good. Item has arrived. Very nice. I think I already put it on the right slot. Yes, it is. Gargantuan animal. Another mature shock serpent. And put this bad boy in there. And now we move on. Okay. Let's go. Good. I really hope it is something interesting though. Like if it's just a random structure that we have seen before, but I just didn't recognize, that would be such a shame. But I'm really happy about these things. Uh, so two vampire, well, vampire spider queen and a vampire spider baby. That's very, very nice to have. Okay, you are good there. Yeah, you can just defend this or something. I don't know. I don't really think we need it, but might as well start defending shit. Uh, Spanish is beautiful. I learned some in high school, but most of it vanished over time. Um, I'm hesitating between German and Russian now. Dude, they're both hard languages. Really hard. Oof. German, I mean, I speak German, but it's, it's... Dude, it's really, it's, it's not an easy language to learn, especially for... You know, if oh, with all the with all the uh, pronunciation-wise, I, I think it's not that difficult. It's more the the um, the articles and stuff like that uh, are are a nightmare because there's so many in German. And I think it's Spanish as well, if I remember correctly. Um, okay. Oh, I forgot about this guy. This guy is to move forward as well. Festival of Magic. Get some mana. Research breakthrough. Whoop -dee -dee. Okay. We're just producing units left, right, and center here. Uh, again, don't think I'll need them particularly, but we might as well if we... If we already have them anyway. So let's see. Let's make some decent armies here. So this is a a pretty pretty decent army. This army is alright. I would like to have someone lead them though. I mean Yeah, I guess I guess this guy can lead them. Maybe we should get this guy out of the out of the army as well and have him lead his own army. Let's have these apprentices in there. That guy. And then some of these some of these serpents, I guess. Cause why not? That way we'll have we'll have another decent army. And then you can lead your own army as well. Actually, let's do it like this.
Yeah, so this one has a little bit more XP, so I'm gonna give him this army. And then you guys, the random units can just hang out here all together, I guess. I'll just send this guy, these guys along just because they're decent units. And do I actually send these in as well? The, the, the trebuchets might be nice, right? I think they're gonna be nice. Let's just let's just keep keep moving forward like this. Okay. Oh, that's uh, very very disappointing, but sure. It's just a shrine. Nothing we can take uh, here. Um, stone giant cannot cannot take that. Uh, is there anything else of interest here? Not really. I don't know why they put that in such a random spot. Well, it doesn't really matter. Um, we can move back now with these guys and then uh, just head back above ground. Uh, also with them, I'm probably just going to move back. The, the prospect can just generate more, more gold for us, I guess. Uh, we don't need more gold, but I mean, we might as well. Mm, you can stay there. Uh, yes, Daddy Das uh, is is. I mean, that's just the beginning, you know. Oof. Uh, I didn't see what you decided with your goblin colonies. Uh, will they remain goblin or turn draconian? So for now, I decided to to just absorb everything, just to not become more evil. Uh, since our uh, since our golden dragon is is really being affected by our. Um, by our decisions to become evil. So, you know, it's a, it's a very unhappy boy. But uh, luckily we've been able to, to manage our, this unhappiness with um, with the help of the Touch by Faith and stuff like that. Um, actually, we can put the Cockatrice in, in, in the army with our leader. Yeah, let's do that. Because we still have one spot left open here. Do we still have points somewhere that we can spend four points? Um, let's get healing, obviously. I'm surprised I didn't get that already. Uh, let's do some scouting. Uh, okay, sure. Oh no, it's an... Oh, he has tanks. I don't like it. I don't like it. One bit. Let's take out the first of his units here. I don't think we, I don't think we have to worry about any sort of retaliation attack from, from their side. Uh, just yet, because uh, well, we don't see any units um, over over here that can particularly hurt us. So, um, yeah, I think we should be good. Okay, well, this group of random units is just there. Okay, let's see. What do you do? Okay, some units are coming after us. Which is all right, because we still have units down here as well that we can use to defend ourselves. Let's see, you are going to get this, and then you can go after that army. You guys can take this out, get some more mana for us, although we don't actually need it very good okay now we can at least see if there's something sneaking past us here but it doesn't seem like there is the cockatrice can go in here in this army and you guys can take care of of these bad boys right here 
And I'll just keep the trebuchets back a little bit. Um, I know that there's another trebuchet in there uh, that we can use. Okay, some more knowledge. Some more knowledge. Sure. And oof, convert is really good. Holy champion. So there's a there's a lot of, of buffs that we can get now, and uh, some party buffs that we we should actually get. So aura of resistance, I really really like. Um, I think resistance in, in buffing resistance in general is great. Horned God, well that's great obviously. Bless is really nice. Let's get the spell as well. Fifty two left. Don't really think I we can do anything with that. Hmm. Yeah, that's not so great. I mean, this doesn't really matter anymore, I guess. Um, let's just summon a Horned God. I guess we might as well. Maybe maybe I'll, I'll, I'll substitute the, the, the Cockatrice for, for a Horned God soon. I think that's going to be good. Uh, sure. You're good. A Prospector can just do its thing. And you can park here. You can park here. Good. Let's then turn. What? Uh, okay. Okay, they're moving back. Hey, that's interesting. So now that we've attacked them, they are starting to move and, and gather up the mana? That is interesting to me. Uh, hey, SD. Hey, Cyber Penguins. Uh, how are you doing, guys? Happy New Year to the both of you. Uh, plan from the first of the right of fun uh, because the translation is so <laughs> really <laughs> assault bikes. It's a cool one. Prime a bomb. Oh my goodness, that is horrible translations. Oh my goody goodness. Yeah, that is terrible. That is absolutely terrible. So let's see. Okay, they made some. They made it again. Man, I don't know why Emperor eyes make these positional mistakes. You know. We can uh, pick them off quite easily here. Luckily. Uh, let's do something like that, like that, like that. Hopefully like that. No, definitely not like that. I think there should be more than enough to deal with uh, to deal with those enemies, though. This is, uh, let's see. We can just auto combat this. I think yes, we can. Good, good, and then you guys can join these units as well. Okay, let's go manual combat. Uh, still not cold enough here, essential. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, here is here is also not not very cold. Uh, it was so warm yesterday. It felt it felt really weird. Like you. See, you you know, I I remember like twenty years ago, the it was freezing on New Year's Eve pretty much every single time. We had snow and everything, and now you know we were standing outside with ten degrees on you know at night. It's so weird how how the weather has changed so drastically, and it's not even that that long ago, you know. Okay, let's move off all of these bad boys over here. Apparently we don't need the ram because they don't have walls. And let's still be vigilant and you know awaken spirit and do all that 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 kind of jazz. Good. Good, good. 
it's so nice that they have this ability in uh, the, the draconian elders because in every single battle you're guaranteed to get some experience it doesn't matter if they participated in a battle at all it you're just gonna get experience let's see if i forget forgot someone yes i did good that i checked and obviously the dragon ancestry is is, uh, is great because it gives fire strike as well um, yeah, this flame tank is not going to do anything to my, uh, to my elders. And also not the fire wyverns, I think. Nope, they also have 100% fire protection. So now we can slowly but surely move forward. Keep a few of these shamans on the... Or the elders on the right-hand side. And then my main army is just gonna, gonna come rushing in uh, through the middle. Uh, let's just get rid of that thing. <laughs> 66 damage for a 5 HP fence, but sure, I guess. Bit of overkill. Doesn't matter. Let's see, can we doom gaze anything? Mm, well, no. Okay, we can use the golden dragon here as, as a defensive measure. Uh... Let's try and do that. That worked like a charm. Uh, Druid's Waken is similar to the Theocrit's ability. Bless. Um, no, 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 no. Uh, so the Awakened Spirit just gives uh, armor. Uh, it just gives um, uh, um, melee strength, I think. No, just strength. Just more damage and more happiness. So the the what the Bless does. Here, I can actually show you because I have it. Uh, bless gives uh, armor resistance and happiness. So it's, uh, it's, it's, you know, it does give, uh, give, um, um, similar buffs, but not really. Like this one, it gives more defensive and, and, um, Awakened Spirit is more offensively used. Good. Again, we don't want to be losing any of our heroes since then we lose the game, which is not the idea. Um, not the spell. It's not called Bless. Oh, the touch by faith, the finger. Um, no, the finger gives resist resistance, right? I think we have that in this army as well, somewhere. No, I don't think so. Must be another army. Let's see what the enemy does. Any plans for the new year? Yes, I have. Um, I am gonna um, gonna start learning Spanish. Uh, that's been on my on my to do list for a while now, and now I actually. Uh, you know, and I do want to get to it at some point. So that's uh Yes, it does give XP to the caster, yes. Uh but yeah, now now it's finally it's finally time for me to, to actually uh start start doing that. But um apart from that, I I don't I don't know man. New Year's resolutions are like if you want to do something, then just do it, and you don't have to wait for for you know New Year's really, New Year's to come around to to start doing stuff. At least that's how I see it. Let's do this. Move this guy out of the way a little bit. Okay, so you have broken spirit, but nothing else. Not no days, right? So I'm gonna get my my spider out of here. I do want to get rid of this cannon as soon as possible. And I think I can with uh, with these guys. Hmm. Can I get rid of this tank here? The cockatrice does a lot of damage. Okay, that's nice. That is not too bad. Hmm. I'm gonna keep this guy back a little bit at least. Good. 
Okay, now what? Now what indeed? Let's just see how much damage we do with the cockatrice and uh, see if we actually kill it. We do not, but it's gonna die from the burning. From immolated. It does have some fire protection, but I know not enough to... To negate all of this. Okay, let's see. Can we get... Can we take this out? Okay, since I cannot attack the these guys, I'm just going to attack the flame tank here to just get rid of it. To not take too much damage from the explosive death when I have these guys in place. That is one. I do want the King Shock Serpent in here as well. None. Unfortunately, that was pretty much it. Okay, so that's dead. I'm gonna use the raptor here as a as a distraction. And let's heal something. Let's heal the cockatrice while we are while we're at it. Hmm. Don't think I need to do anything with this this unit just yet. And these guys can just come forward. Good. Okay. We're sort of getting there. I am deciding on anything new and just uh, plants all the parks. <laughs> hey, but not making any plants is no uh, is not the way to go, you know. Uh, let's kill this with our shock serpent. Get some XP on that. Oh, almost level up. Let's go. Munch. Oh, that was the wrong one. <laughs> I thought this was the enemy unit. I completely saw that wrong. Never mind then. This guy dead. Um, dead. Dead. And that is that. Very nice. Last one unit? No units. Very nice. Very good indeed. Should be more than enough anyway to kill uh, to kill these last couple of units here. I'm just gonna auto combat this. There's nothing really scary about this. Um, <laughs> it would be so funny to see like auto combat and then you lose your 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 leader randomly and then you just lose because of fucking auto combat. <laughs> that would be pretty hilarious. Uh, Earth node is occupied. Oh, okay. Oh. That is annoying. I'm just going to move back with these guys, I guess. Uh, another shock trooper. Yeah, sure. Hero has leveled. Sure. Let's get that. Let's absorb this bad boy and yeah, there's I mean there's I don't think there's any point to to now it's just a matter of time right which which is in my opinion this is like the the the, the one of the worst parts about about uh, H one three actually is that you what? is it still. No, it's mine now, right? It's just a cleanup afterwards. I mean, there should be just be an option for surrender, even in campaigns, I think. Uh, let's just do that. Do that. But then again, this is supposed to help people um, who have played the game before, right? So it's maybe 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 that's not the right approach anyway. Good. Let's move all of these guys forward. Uh, 
good, good, good. Mm. Yeah. And the turn doesn't really matter. I just want to get through this now as, as soon as possible. Uh, Horned Gold is going to be nice. Um, maybe, maybe we could have it in this army as well, but... Actually, let's put it in this army. Let's put the Hunter somewhere else. Go over there. What? Why did you move around? Okay, almost there, boys. Almost there. Uh, what have we here? Fugitive Oblivions. Oh, I had a light fall. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Never! Spell Jammer. Okay. Oh, okay. Is the units in there or something? What's the what's the what's the idea? Okay, so luckily it's uh, it's just a few humans, so the the siege is not going to be very difficult. That is great. Uh, let's. Oh, wait. Oh, that is it, really. Raise. Okay. Uh, sure. That. Park. Uh, and turn. <laughs> Look at this condensed ma uh, stack of units. Okay, let's make it one big battle. I'm just gonna auto combat this because again, I don't see any point why we uh, why we should waste time here. I actually want these guys to be in there because I want the trebuchets. Um, uh, nope, that is not what I wanted. I wanted this, and then no, no spells. Okay. I thought for a second that I that one of my guys died. I thought for a second that that one of my units died. Oh my goodness! When a pop up came, I was like. <gasps> Luckily, uh, everything went as, as predicted and as planned. Um, but man, my... Uh, that was a little bit scary. Good. Ought to come at this. Get some mana. Let's get out of here. Where can you guys move? You can take that. Take that. Good. Let's see. Two more cities. Uh, one... This one is almost non-existent. There's no borders or anything like it. No. Well. Here, just defend this or something. Um, let's just summon another horn god just because we can. And it's going to be done in two turns anyway. Uh, there's another one of our spell jammers. Not yet. Let's see, get this bad boy in there. And let's attack. 
kill those bad boys. Okay, that seems like a very easy battle as well. Luckily no more Shadow Stalkers or cannons or tanks that we have to worry about. Okay, there's another city over here. I don't think we need to take it though. Because their leader is on uh, is is on here and that is Death Throne City, so uh, we'll just ignore that city up here. <coughs> Oh, there was another one. Um, good, and turn. Don't need all of this. This hunter has become pretty useless, so I'm gonna send this guy back, summon a horn god in here, because why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. Let's raise. Okay, it's just a ram. Nothing too exciting. I think uh, I'm gonna do a manual this even. I don't think there's any point. I think I think this is an easy easy battle. I don't think we need to manual this, to be honest. So yeah, let's just do this. Let's just also combat it uh, and then be done with this uh, with this playthrough. Let's go. And it's also been an hour approximately, so that's good. Uh, so yeah, finally, finally, <laughs> we managed to 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 win this one. I mean, it took way longer than I expected. Uh, so I thought that that each of these playthroughs would maybe take approximately an hour just like I think the, the previous ones did um, but yeah this one took way longer I mean it's it's a it's a larger map as well right I mean I should have realized when I saw the larger map that there was also gonna be more uh, more things to take out and stuff like that but yeah in the end uh, we managed to do it differently I think than the creators intended it to do because I mean, I think you're supposed to be good in this playthrough, and we kind of went evil. And then, uh, you know, the Golden Dragon was not really too happy with us uh, all the time. But we managed. We managed to, to make him happier throughout the um, the playthrough. Which is great. And yeah, finally managed to complete this one. Um, we are victorious indeed. Completed quest. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know what the statistics really say about this, to be honest. Uh, but uh, in a normal game, I can sort of relate, you know, the amount of, of um, progression you have throughout the game um, with like the knowledge and the score and the, and the military. You can sort of tell, but in this game, the enemy starts off with a giant territory already, and and you start off with something, and then you have to sort of build it. So yeah, don't really think uh, they should have included this part in in the. Uh, in the campaign, but whatever doesn't really matter anyway. We uh, we managed to defeat uh, our last enemy. Uh, that means we'll be moving on to the next campaign uh, shortly. Um, yeah, in the next one, who knows what'll act, uh, what'll what <laughs> what is expected of us? Uh, I guess we'll you'll have to wait and find out. Uh, um, but yeah, for now. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you like this sort of content, then uh, consider leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.